Hi, this is Kiran and I am the author and founder of uh, Traffic Squeezer and Aquarium and uh, this is the video about uh, how I can, how you can actually do a sort of uh, 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 Samsung uh, Galaxy Tab 2 uh, recovery mode. Uh, offline I found some issues uh, with respect to uh, opening any applications and uh, uh, recently after uh, doing an upgrade still it is not helping me out and uh, and I am struck and I can't use my tablet anymore it is like the Samsung have a initial uh, welcome uh, screen where uh, somewhere down the lane it tries to open some uh, input box so uh, that time it is uh, not able to do it anymore and uh, so I can't almost use my tablet anymore so after a long uh, sequence of debug and uh, I, I figured out uh, this is something which I can't even recover with my uh, with the Samsung key uh, software and I just installed in Windows and tried it and still it is not able to be done and uh, finally I just figured out uh, there is a sort of recovery mode uh, which uh, as you can see on the screen uh, to make it more visible actually I just turned off the lights and uh, so that you can see the screen with uh, no uh, sort of background uh, lighting as much as possible so I kind of uh, going to zoom in the options so you get this sort of recovery screen if you sort of power press the power button and the volume button in a sort of a sequence and you can just uh, hold it for quite a long time and then uh, this um, um, recovery mode starts so I'm just zooming in and as you can see uh, you can uh, just uh, select the options with a volume button and uh, uh, as a sort of in terms of navigating whichever you want and power button to select so I just want to do a factory default uh, uh, factory reset and I just want to figure out uh, is this going to help me in terms of solving this problem so let's uh, do this and I'm just uh, going to do this uh, wipe data and factory reset so let me see what it is going to happen so in terms of uh, preventing the same they have uh, neatly given all these options and I can just um, navigate towards yes delete all user data so I just don't want anything and let's see what it happens so So it looks like the process is done. So so let's just uh, do a reboot and see what it is going to happen. Once again I am reminding you I just turned off the light so that you can see the screen or the display much clearer exit. so let's just see what it is going to do is this going to help me or not if it is not helping me around then after a couple of retries I am just really going to take it to the Samsung service center let me just see the only thing I'm worried is I got this in US and uh, I need to give it to the service center here in India so I really don't know how it is going to work out so let's just see is taking quite a long time let's just wait and see
I am sorry for the delay. Looks like it is still doing some operation. And uh, let's. I just don't want to stop this video recording. I am just. So let's just wait. Ah, cool. Oh my goodness. Finally, I can see the options. Oh. Earlier, I was really, really struck. Ah. This is nice. This is the same as when I just got it. So I am just turning off the Wi-Fi. You can see the options here. I am just, you, if you do this, it will enable. I, I just don't want any Wi-Fi now because it will tend to upgrade or do something. So let me do skip and uh, looks like the time can be set later. Uh, skip so that's it uh, not now looks like I am done huh thank god I can see this keyboard <coughs> almost after couple of weeks believe me and uh, nothing started working in this end uh, let me just type my name my name is first name let me just type it so looks like i'm done and uh, thank god it's it's a it's a cool experience oh my goodness i finally i got my tablet working and it is back so really i i believe it is uh, going to save your time and uh, don't get panic and uh, sometimes you don't actually need to go to the service center and you can just do this by yourself because i kind of uh, locked in a deadlock uh, just just a minute i switch on my lights well there you go so here is my device I'm just opening it so uh, the thing is uh, you don't need to go to the service center and you can do this and really I was struck in a sort of a deadlock the reason is um, uh, it is no more uh, allowing me to go to any other screen it is just struck there and uh, i can't really proceed so uh, so in that mode actually the samsung kia c is also of offering me no help absolutely whatsoever so the only option left is just doing this way so uh, one one final thing i can really show along with that i have my mobile which is again a samsung based uh, Android phone and uh, I'm just uh, enabling my Wi-Fi hotspot mode uh, let me just do it and check if there are any updates available because as you can see I have done a factory default settings see if you see uh, it should have a sort of software upgrade and uh, I just select to select your country I, sometimes these upgrades are country specific so I think uh, I can just enable this confirm so it shows unable to connect to the network so I'm just uh, turning on my Wi-Fi settings and I can say tethering and uh, portable hotspot I can select portable Wi-Fi hotspot it shows this warning you can uh, select uh, cool so it is enabled now I can uh, connect and then I can retry you know upgrade because since it is set as factory default settings you may need to update your uh, upgrade your device actually so it's it's around um, sort of 
what to say it's it's around uh, middle of the night as you can see it is uh, around 2 a.m but i was kind of worried because uh, since i am not able to use my tablet i'm kind of really worried and, uh, so let me see and i should able to connect wi-fi i'm just enabling it and it shows this wi-fi network so let me just type its password and i don't mind showing it to you i don't remember what its password is tethering and wi-fi hotspot settings yep uh, Wi-Fi hotspot settings. Uh, let me just see. Show password. Okay, fine. Traffic squeezer five six seven. Okay, fine. Okay. So let me go to the settings. Thank God again I can see this keyboard working and earlier it is completely stopped working actually for quite a long time and I'm just using the tablet just to read any books and nothing much. Now once again I can use it for anything other than just reading the books. So it's it's connected. So it is connected. You can see the status and you can see the status over here. It has the Wi-Fi uh, logo and uh, let's now uh, run it over. Uh, uh, don't actually this is my word of caution. Don't much fiddle around the developer options where I'm pointing my finger onto. So don't much fiddle around these settings. Actually somewhere it got some nasty bug and i think that is when it got enabled so as you can see this is my build version and other details so it neatly shows um, all these details and let me just check software upgrade option so i i uh, i need to select my country because sometimes this upgrade is country specific so it really makes sense if you are in US or some specific region it may be a sort of upgrade meant for your region actually and uh, so it shows connecting to the server let's just wait and see so no update available so in that case I suspect maybe it has already got that recent update or there is no update with respect to my country at this point of time so uh, that's about it actually uh, when I bought uh, I, I bought it in US so uh, it has a sort of firmware uh, which is actually installed over there so that's about it so anyway uh, thanks for watching this video and uh, um, so uh, uh, thanks for watching this video feel free to uh, uh, put down your comments and I hope uh, this should be highly useful for you in case if you are struck like me so and uh, I can see a couple of more options over here I really don't know if I set as factory default settings I see it is much more refined than the time when I bought it I I really don't know the reason maybe it has uh, my previous upgrade got successful and it has deleted all my uh, stored uh, settings and configuration I really don't know what what it has done but I see that uh, my device got upgraded actually because I can see a lot more different uh, settings over here earlier I never seen uh, this power saving icon over here so now they have made it as a hot icon and i really don't know what else the changes they have done so uh, that's about it so uh, thank you for watching this video kindly feel free to post your comments okay thank you have a nice day bye